Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're talking about Tom Thumb engines and tools, and particularly how we can use our tools, or some of them, to make our engines work better and get our tasks done. So I went on the internet and I printed out what the definition of a tool is. The definition of a tool is a piece of equipment that you use with your hands to make or repair something, i.e. a power tool or a machine tool. Another definition is something that helps you do a particular activity. So a lot of times in our shops when we think of tools, we think about hammers, pliers, wrenches, um, screwdrivers, different variety of tools to help us do our job in our hit and miss engine shop. Let me bring you back over here and put it back on the tripod and I'll tell you about another tool that we can use also. And that is that little black thing sitting up there. These are commonly called voice activated um, devices. And if you look right here, I'm gonna try to do this. If you look right up there, right up there on the very top, you'll soon will see a blue or green ring. And those, um, I'll explain to that in a minute. So a voice activated device um, is just that. It's, it's something that's connected to the internet. And it also um, has a, you, you have to put an app on your phone. And I'm not going to get into all the different ways you can use one of these things because it's easy to go on the internet and find out the thousands and thousands of different ways to use them. Um, but here in a hit and miss engine shop, I have a particular way that I use them and I wanted to share for you. So um, there's different manufacturers that manufacture these things. So you have to look and uh, particularly see what brand you like. Um, this is the Amazon uh, device and its activation word is Alexa. So when you see the blue ring come on, when you say that activation word, that means that she is listening and ready to take your command. So Alexa, Sorry. Alexa cancel. So how I use my device, activate voice activated device, um, in my shop is, is several different ways. One of the things I use it mostly for is if I'm painting something, got your trusty dusty cam of Rust-Oleum here. And if you read the directions, it says, you read the directions and it says may recoat or clear coat within one hour or 48 hours. So usually I wait about, I don't know, two to three minutes before coat recoats. And um, so an example of what I can do is say something like this, Alexa, set a reminder for two minutes. What's the reminder for? Apply second coat of paint. Okay. I'll remind you in two minutes. So now she started a clock, a countdown clock. Um, and, and when that two minutes is expired, uh, that ring on the top will come up and let me know that it's time to recoup. Another thing you can that I do here in my shop is if there's a particular project I'm doing and I get distracted, um, or I need to take a phone call or whatever it is, I can say, Alexa, set an alarm. Alarm for what time? Two minutes. Two minutes, starting now. So you can set an alarm, and in my mind, when an alarm comes on, it kind of reminds me that I need to go do something. Um, another thing that I do with my Alexa in my shop is this is getting back to the Tom Thumb engine project over here is that you can create a shopping list. Now what's advantageous about creating a shopping list for your engine or your particular project is you can create multiple lists at one time, but also it sends that list to the app on your phone. So if you need to go get some parts, you take your phone with you into the Ace Hardware or wherever you're going, 
and you have a shopping list there that's with you. So for example, I could say, Alexa, create a new shopping list. What should I add? Add new spring. New spring added. What else? Two cans of paint. I've added two cans of paint to your shopping list. What else? One cup of grease. I've added one cup of grease to your shopping list. What else? That's it. Okay. So now you've got that. This is a reminder. Apply second coat of paint. This is a reminder. Apply second coat of paint. So that two minutes has expired. You seen that it come on and it showed it, the blue ring came on and it showed us that we had a reminder. And that's what we were, were reminded to do. Now we would go out and put our second coat of paint on. Um, getting back to the shopping list. And so now those items that I put on the shopping list has, uh, it's on my phone. So I walk into the store, I can get a new spring, I can get some spray paint, I can get a can of grease. Okay, now it's shown us our two minute alarm. Alexa, cancel alarm. So these, these are four days when you're, when you're there in the shop and you're working a lot. Also, you can make phone calls and send text messages. That's some of the general items that, um, that you know, are, are capable with all of these devices. What I use it for is um, a lot of times I'll ask to get a parts list. So I'll say, Alexa, I need a parts list. Oh, Alexa, create a parts list. That was parts, right? Yes. I've created parts list. What should I add to it? Add a new spark plug. I've added new spark plug to your parts list. What other items do you want to add? Uh, let's see, I want to add a can of grease. I've added a can of grease to your parts list. What else would you like to add? Uh, a new spring. I've added new spring to your parts list. What else? That's it. Okay. And so on and so on. So in your particular shop, um, if you want to say you're going to do a project on Thursday, and when you get there on Thursday, you want to remind yourself to, um, I don't know, clean the spark plug. So you can set yourself a reminder for something in the future. Alexa, set a reminder. What's the reminder for? Clean the spark plug. When should I remind you? Next Thursday. What time Thursday should I remind you? Uh, 11 a.m. Okay, I'll remind you Thursday at 11 a.m. So there's literally thousands of things you can do, but the, I, I have found that this device, any one of them, are really, um, really, really good in my shop and it, help, it helps me remember stuff while I got it on my mind and be able to um, put it down as opposed to writing it down. I used to write down a lot of things and I'd have notes scattered everywhere and I couldn't remember what to do with my notes. So um, some other kind of non hit and miss engine but in the shop type stuff is we all have had that situation where we just can't get that bolt loose or get that nut loose or something's frustrating us. And uh, one good feature this thing has that always kind of takes that frustration away from me is I say, Alexa, tell me a bad joke. My bedside table broke after one day. Oh, well, I guess it was just a one night stand. So <laughs> that kind of helps ease attention. And kind of last but not least is I um, like to listen to music and everybody that knows me knows I like bluegrass music. So while you're in the shop working, you can say, Alexa. Alexa, play bluegrass music. The station, bluegrass, free on Amazon Music.
And you can listen your little heart away. Alexa, cancel. So if you were um, interested in one of these things and maybe set one up in your shop, let me tell you what you're going to need. Obviously, you're going to need a, a place to be able to plug it in. Um, I have it plugged in here to my toolbox, which is obviously plugged into the wall. You're going to need a wireless internet connection. Um, this is this one is at my uh, garage at my house, so we have that that feature here. And um, download the app on your phone, on your smartphone, and um, you'll be you'll be set up and ready to go. So this is just meant to be another little avenue of things that can help us all out in our shop. If it works for you, try it out. If it doesn't, then uh, maybe you can pass this information along to somebody else. Okay, everybody. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.